you will need the following tools. A 7 64th inch Allen wrench, quarter inch Allen wrench, lint free cleaning cloth, and safety glasses. The QB3 repair kit contains a pedestal with o-ring, the inlet spring, a loaded inlet valve, a piston exhaust valve assembly, grease, and a volume booster o-ring. Step 1. Invert the unit and remove the lid screws with a 764 Allen wrench. Step 2. Remove the lid and clean any visible debris with a lint-free cloth. Step 3. Connect an airline to the outlet port and apply approximately 10 pounds to help unseat the piston. Remove the piston and set it aside. Disconnect your air supply. Step 4. Use quarter inch Allen wrench to remove pedestal, inlet valve, and spring. Carefully remove the lid o-ring. Clean out the interior of the manifold with a lint-free cloth. Compressed air may also be used to remove debris. Step 5. Prepare the contents of your repair kit. Step 6. Apply a fresh, even coat of grease to the manifold interior. Remember to apply grease inside the pedestal housing as well. Step 7. Place the inlet valve spring into the manifold interior. Step 8. Apply grease to the inlet valve o-ring, install it onto the inlet valve, and center the inlet valve over the spring inside the manifold interior. Step 9. Insert the pedestal through the inlet valve and tighten with a quarter inch wrench. Step 10. Remove the o-ring from the piston exhaust valve assembly if necessary. Notice the exhaust valve comes pre-assembled in the piston. Apply grease to the o-ring and reinstall it onto the piston exhaust valve assembly. Step 11. Carefully insert the piston and exhaust valve assembly into the manifold body. Connect an airline to the inlet port and apply approximately 10 pounds of pressure. Step 12. Pressing the piston down with both thumbs will ensure it is level, moving freely, and all of the o-rings have seated properly. After the piston has been properly seated, remove the air supply. Step 13. The last volume booster o-ring in the kit is for the lid. Grease it evenly and place it into the groove of the manifold. Step 14. Place the lid on the manifold insert screws, and tighten in an alternating sequence. Your QB3 repair kit installation is complete.